going on everybody randy here aka striker struck and i'm going to give you a walk around of my 2024 polaris xp 1000 ultimate there's not too many videos online right now of fully accessorized xp ultimates and where you can get those parts so i thought i'd share my journey and uh my unit so i'm gonna try to do this uncut as fast as possible and give you an idea of where i got some of my stuff at this is her 2024 xp 1000 ultimate so as you can see right off the hop i found a light bar listen light bars you can get them anywhere as long as they're right sized you can mount them doesn't matter curved straight as long as it's the right size you're good to go it doesn't matter where you get it from i got this windshield fully glass windshield i couldn't get one from polaris because it was on back order but i got one from super atv in california and it was around the same price and i ended up getting it like the same week and i really like um so it comes with these vents as well because a lot of people complain especially in the maritimes east coast canada that it gets too hot when you have a full cab so these vents are absolutely amazing and the wind and the airflow that comes through is is really really good i got these full upper doors i got these from polaris these were in stock they come with the handles so that you can um, open them and close them from the outside obviously super convenient and pretty airtight the only non airtight spot was just this little corner down here you can see it from the inside but overall the fitment on these doors were super awesome same thing with the rear floodlights i got them hooked up as well but they came with the light bar so i installed them as extra lighting for when i'm in reverse or backing up or tailgating i got these two storage units from the Polaris website. I got my little cooler bag in here. It fits perfect cooler bag from Cabela's for those ice cold beverages. And I also got the bigger storage here, which I carry squeegee and stuff like that to keep my window and any other supplies. But these storage units are fucking awesome. They are pricey, but they are uh, super worth the price. Um, just because of the fitment and how convenient it is, I wasn't really a big fan of um, paying that price. But again, options were limited, and it really um, it really sucked when it come to uh, finding what you could um, use in that space. I mean, the tunnel cover. I'm sure you guys have seen the tunnel cover. The tunnel cover is pretty nice as well. But I wanted to keep some stuff separate. The girl, she's a little dirty right now. We use her. I got these door bags. These came from the Polaris website as well. They just snap on, super firm. They have a knee pad right here. <sighs> Love the door bags. Um, what else? I got this mirror. It also acts as a light, a dome light, which is super nice as well. And super convenient because you're always trying to find stuff in the dark and you don't have a light and people are using their phone flashlights and yada 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 but yeah also got these whips um just a little shorty whips which was super easy to install there was already holes here that we were not utilizing so it's actually super slick super easy install the rear window i got dark tinted this come from super atv as well and this was actually cheaper than i thought and the fitment is absolutely off the charts there's no airflow no water gets through <clears throat> it's uh super nice super clean and i've had water literally over the entire unit and there's no water that gets in this with the way they've designed it their accessories the fitment it's uh it's absolutely amazing what they've done to this unit i'll just give it a start for you they've done such an amazing job on this unit between the bucket seats the harnesses which i thought would annoy me the little glove compartments here with the charging cable um, built right inside the ride command the um stereo Rock 
Kirk Foskate, full, full stereo. I also got this here bag. I actually got that off of Amazon to add storage. It doesn't bother me with my helmet or anything like that. It gives definitely enough clearance. Another big upgrade, obviously, is the suspension. Um, listen, guys, this ride is super, super comfortable. And I am thoroughly impressed. So hopefully this, got, this helps you. I got most of my stuff. Um, between Polaris website and Super ATV, I've literally tried tens, 20, 30 different websites in different places, and it just wasn't happening. So I know it's only early, and there's not a lot of stuff out there, but that's the the best options that I can show you. But I absolutely love this machine, and I uh, can't wait to take it for a next next journey.